time I have volume according to my test. About a hundred years ago, a chemist in Germany named Huber or Haber discovered how to make nitrogen. And this was used in explosives, but later they used it as fertilizer. And uh, plants need nitrogen. It's kind of a dope for plants. Uh, with it, they grow like crazy. Without it, they don't. And Mother Nature supplies it in not so abundant amounts frequently. So well, when they started using it as a fertilizer in the cage later, got huge increases in crops, especially the corn, which was uh, able to make especially a large use of it. So we now produce a mountain of corn out in the good old Midwest where it don't rain no more. Now this had a major effect on us on practically everything. We uh, eat artificial food because of it. Most of the corn is what they call type 2, which is stuff you wouldn't eat because it tastes lousy. But they break it down into components and make all this artificial food that we live on and make the uh, businessmen so happy because you don't have to ha change it every three days which you would have to do with real food because it won't keep. So, <coughs> that was a remarkable amount of a difference it made for us over the years. Uh, we all sit in a house of cards. A bunch of uh, chemistry and greedy people and stuff like that. And I'm getting all this stuff from this book, The Omnivores of Inner by Michael Pollan. And I recommend it to everybody for a reality dose. 